On any given morning in Yellowstone National Park, you can find packs of tourists watching for packs of wolves. My spirit just feels such a resonance with what I'm seeing. Wolf watchers bring more than their high-powered scopes. They bring money to area businesses, about $35 million a year. They're probably the most popular pack in the park. They're celebrity wolves? I, I would say so. Seventy years ago, aggressive hunting and trapping all but wiped out the wolves here, until the federal government decided that as predators, they were a key link in the park's food chain. So starting in 1995, they brought the wolves back to Yellowstone. They released 41 here in the park. They were housed in pens like this. They were hoping that they would have pups and eventually they'd end up with about 100. Now, a decade later, the pens are overgrown and there are more than 300 wolves in the Yellowstone area, 1,300 in the three surrounding states. But it's a great view of them. There are so many wolves now, Washington's considering taking wolves in the Yellowstone area off the endangered species list which means okay, they'll be yeah. fair game for hunters. Do you see beauty in these creatures? No, absolutely not. How could you? Rancher James Felton says he lost upwards of $40,000 last month when a wolf attacked one of his calves on his land near Yellowstone. I shouldn't have wolves on my ranch chewing on my livestock. I didn't want them here in the first place. Nobody ran, no other rancher did. Why are we taking the brunt? Since 1995, wolves have killed more than a thousand sheep and cattle in the Yellowstone area. Under current law, a rancher can shoot a wolf if he can prove his livestock was attacked. So far, more than 260 wolves have been killed, including one by Felton. In your opinion, how many wolves should there be in this area? Zero. Conservationists warn that taking wolves off the endangered list will once again turn predators into prey. They could very well end up on the endangered species list again, and we don't want to see that happen. They use their Early next year, the government will decide whether that's a real threat or just crying wolf. Tracy Smith, CBS News, Yellowstone.